Welcome to Wooly Bees on what not to do when setting up a starter. Don't drop the top box. Yeah, you should have seen all the bees in the air. Got bees on the ground. But the most important thing is right there. I've already found her. So, got to figure, I'm feeling I'm going to have some stings on the ankles, some stings on the hands. I did have enough sense to go put my inspector's jacket on, because, no, I ain't touching this without that. So, I guess what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this phone on the tripod and get started. This ought to be fun. Guess I need to figure out the best angle. So you guys can see this. Tell you what, let's just go get a get a, a block. And see what that does for the angle. Oh yeah, that ought to be a good angle to watch me get stung up. used to me being in a suit you get your first treat the sad thing is the frame I was going to draft out of is in that box so after having this hive open for 20 minutes trying to find the hide-and-go-seek champ of the world for 2019 she passed Sasquatch and the abominable snowman I guess oh this is gonna be fun it's upside down too so This is going to be a lot of fun. I swear if I don't kill all these bees in this box, I don't know what I'm doing. But, as you've seen, I've yet to get stung. So I would say that's a testament. And high tool, no earthly clue. Oh well. Testament to how gentle these bees are. But you'll know the minute one goes up my leg, because I'll go to dancing. Hot, sweaty. Like I said, I've been standing here for 20 minutes trying to find clean in that box. Oh, this is going to be lovely at all them bees on the ground. Well, let's try to find a frame to graft off of. I've got to graft off this girl. Alright, that's my dummy frame. Another dummy frame. Well, I'm a dummy. The frames are going to grab off of, darn it, are on the bottom. I.e., the one that hit the ground. So, not only are they mad from hitting the ground, Be mad 
it and me trying to take a frame and draft out of it too, and that's a solid frame of brew. I mean, you can see why I want to graft out of this girl. Solid. We'll get some grass and show you a trick Les Crowder teaches folks. I don't ever use a bee brush. Now that you see how I've got it back together. Oh, got one going up my sleeve. How'd you get in there? Now the next part is getting all of those and all of those back up in the hive. So right now I'm going to go graft, shut the video off. Once I come back, I'll start it up again and show you how I'm going to get those bees off the ground into the hive. See you in a few. All right, I'm back. Got the graft done. Graphs in, and this is how I'm going to get all of these back in the hive. Just a frame of old brood comb with nothing in it. All I'm doing is just shaking them on top, setting it back down on top of them, letting them climb on it for a minute or so, dumping them back in. That's all I'm going to do till the end of the, oh, probably till I got most of them. I'm not going to worry about them too much. They're already crawling up the side to crawl in. I'm going to give them a little ramp to the side. But don't get on this and I'd get tired of they'll either crawl up the block crawl up the ramp or spend the night on the grass so sad to say these that are not flying back up are the ones I really need in the hive for those grass that's the nurse bees But needless to say, everything's not always perfect here at Woolly Bees. Majority of the time, it's always wrong. 
At least that's what it seems like to me. Seems like nothing ever goes right. But I'm out here with nothing on other than a veil. Still not getting stung. And all my friends down in Texas would not do this, Lester. I definitely know you wouldn't do this. Number one, you probably wouldn't knock them over like I did. Interesting. Got a little ball of bees right here. Let's get over here so we're not standing on everybody. Let's see if we got something that's... See what we got here in this little ball of bees on the ground. Ah, it looks like a piece of wax has probably got honey on it. There's no queen in that. But anytime I see a ball of bees on the ground, I always check it because there's usually a queen amongst them. Anyway, we're going to wrap this video up so I can finish, get this hive closed back together. And let them do their thing about getting back in the hive. Because it's hot out here. Everybody's coming home. And I don't want to get a robbing started on a hive that I'm trying to use as a starter. So guys, if you like the videos... Hit that like and subscribe button. Hit that bell notification thing so you do get a notification. I'm going to put this lid back on those girls. I'm going to go find me a thing of Gatorade. But, like I said, didn't get stung. The whole way through. I'm going to let them go. Let them get back in there. I forgot to put my pollen patty on. but Oh well, I guess they can do without it. Plenty of pollen flow coming in. Have a great day. Mine went south, but I'm still having a great day. <laughs>